Okay, so a, a quick tip here too on making better contact with the golf ball and fixing directional misses by fixing contact. Most of you out there who have taken lessons from me know you've seen this can. And for those of you who don't, it's Dr. Scholl's foot powder and most every teacher out there who uses TrackMan uses it. Uh, and then some to spray the face of the club and know where you are hitting it. Please understand that impact on the club face is a massive, massive influence on what the ball does directionally, not just distance. So many times when I give a lesson, we are fixing slices and hooks simply by where we are hitting it on the face. And many times when you ask a student, do you know where you hit that on the face? The answer is usually no, they don't know. And so if you don't know where you're hitting it on the face, it's so critical for you to spray the club face like I did this picture. You can see the mark in the center of the face on this driver and know for sure where it's on the face. If you can eliminate a contact miss and we know you're hitting it in the middle, then we can check that box off and we can start working on the root problem. But until you fix contact, you cannot fix anything else. Okay, now you might have to go to something else to fix the contact, but first you have to know. So if you're going to the range and you're practicing, one of the things you should be doing is spraying the face of your irons and your woods and seeing where it is. Get your contact point down and let's fix that first before you start working on anything else. And I think it'll be a massive improvement not only in how the ball flies, but when you hit it in the center, you're transferring the most energy to it. We might even pick up a few yards. So get a can of that Dr. Scholl's. Make sure it's Dr. Scholl's, not the other stuff because it's clear. And spray your club face. Keep this in your golf bag and use it every time you go to the practice range to do your work.